Rising unemployment versus increase in sub-Saharan African population is a critical thought for policy makers, even as Nigeria is projected to soon become the third most populous nation in few years to come. The big question is how is Africa preparing for this population explosion? In a paper presentation titled From Manufacturing Led Expert Growth to a 21st Century Inclusive Growth Strategy, Joseph Stiglitz, renowned professor of economics at the Columbian University, said governments will need to play an important role in the new structural transformation towards a modern economy. He argued that while expert led growth was the basis of success of growth over the past half century, the factors that enable manufacturing to provide that growth support would not be able to do so to the same extent in the future. Manufacturing has been the victim of its own success. The rate of increase in productivity, output per person, per hour, has been faster than the great rate of growth of demand. And when that happens, employment goes down. Also speaking, Dr. Donald Kabaruka, a former president of the Africa Development Bank, rejected artificial divisions imposed on Africa, instead preferring to see the continent as one unit and believing that Africa would develop best through continental integration. It was his belief that at the end of the day, Africa will have to belong where others belong, which is in the field of trade and investment. The lecture series will make it possible to sustain that on DIA's values and vision. And in the process, help us build the next generation of leaders of even greater courage, vision, and perseverance. The Babakar and DIA lecture series seeks to honor the late former president of the AFDB for his many contributions to Africa's economic development. From Washington, D.C., I'm there, Katum, Baba, Chile, NTA News.